it started getting dark already. So if you saw the movie Contact, the movie Contact is based on the story of Carl Sagan. Carl Sagan is the one who wanted to listen to the aliens. Behind him there is an organization called Search for Extraterrestrial Intelligence, SETI. If you saw the movie based on him called Contact, in the introduction of the movie, they show how far the TV signals go and while showing the introduction, they show the pictures of a lot of nebulae, the constellations further from our sun. And one of them they show is actually Pillars of Creation. So, Pillars of Creation is an iconic image made by Hubble, Hubble telescope. And when you saw that picture, and when someone tells you that these are the pillars of creation, and when you actually see that in the movie as well, I think it somehow stuck to me saying that I need to see this myself, which is like near impossible. So two years ago, I tried to take a picture of these pillars of creation, which is part of the area Eagle Nebula. And I think I got like really tiny view of those pillars. So there is a big pillar and a small uh, pillar and there is one tiny one as well. And then the year after, which is the last year, I tried to take the picture again. I think I got a slightly better picture, but I think I got the area perfectly done well. But the actual pillars themselves are like quite tiny, almost like a size of postal stamp. So this year I wanted to use the longer focal length telescope to try taking the picture of the pillars of creation. So a lot of people tell me that the longer focal length telescopes are not really geared towards taking the deep space objects unless you have a very expensive mount and expensive uh, camera setup, image train, the whole setup. So I wanted to try using the C14. I have a 1600 camera in the back with the filter wheel. I have astronomic six nanometer filters, the hydrogen, alpha, oxygen, and sulfur. And I'll try to show you guys that picture. If you are new to this channel, I take pictures of comets, galaxies, nebulae, lot of other deep space objects, planets. So if you are interested, please feel free to subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.